Hey, what's going on guys? Teen Outdoor, Teen Outdoors here back at you again with another video. We're out here at this beautiful little creek. Um, we're just going to be throwing around a couple little ultra light lures and seeing what we can't catch. Uh, I got my brother out here at Light Outdoor Entertainment. He'll be in the description. Make sure to go subscribe to him. Watch all his videos and leave a like on this one if you do. And subscribe to me if you enjoy this video. And let's get right into fishing. Alright, we switched to the creek hopper. They seem to be jumping on top of the water. And I see a few fish right here in front of me. So hopefully, this rain that we're having right now will turn the top water bite on. Got one. Yeah. See if we can double up. Oh, he just come off. A small little largemouth. Starting to rain pretty good, but there's a little largemouth. I can see him back. Alright. Catch another one. I'll have to close up my backpack, get my pliers because I just had to bend my hook out. I just hooked into a tree. Can you all see how it bent the hook out right there? I'm just going to take my pliers. I'm just going to. Bend it back like so. Brand new. Catch more fish. I didn't have my camera on, but I got one. I knew that's what it was going to be. Nice little rock bass. I just cast it out there and I just was reeling it in like a little crankbait. Oh, and he's back in the water. What was it? Rock bass. Oh. Just as I was walking away. Elijah's outdoor entertainment over here. He decided he was going to hook up on one. He's using the Rebel Wee Crawl, I think is what it's called. Just a little rock bass. Pretty little fish. He's going to go ahead and toss it back and catch him another one. If you guys can see, this is a pretty cool little rock structure, and over here is the waterfall. I'm going to walk over towards the waterfall area. Maybe there's some more bigger smallmouth over in that area. We'll just have to look and see. I just had a big, bigger smallmouth come up and eat that. I just took my camera off because I thought they had quit biting. And then I found another little spot to go to. And I caught another bass. I'll pop it up on the screen right now. But I caught it on this little uh, zoom trick worm with like a little one on it worm hook. So we're going to keep working down this little trail that I found. And I've got it just weedless like that. Texas rigged. Weightless. And uh, I'm going to work on down this little trail that's over here. And see if there's another one. Got another one. It's a little bit better smallmouth. Pretty little small out right there. Put him back and hopefully catch another one. Got another one. Next cast. Little rock bass. Pretty little rock bass. Put him back. I'm going to make one more cast over here and then I'm going to be done for the day. I'm going to come back to this spot one more time and see if they want the worm. 
If not, we're done. They do want them. Yeah, that's a big smallmouth right there. Got one. It's a rock bass. That smallmouth is what I'm really wanting, and he's still down there. Another real rock bass. Oh man, guys, I just caught the big smallmouth and I wasn't even ready. Yeah, that's a nice one right there. There we go. Now that's a nice smallmouth right there. Been trying to get him this whole time. And he, that just come right out. Holy cow. I'm going to go take a few pictures of this thing and we'll get him back. Alright guys, I think that's a good way to end the video. My camera's on its last bar. We'll go ahead and let this guy back pretty pretty easy. And we'll call that a day. There he goes, man. He put up a good fight.